We are at Me Tattoo, and I'm getting a tattoo. Just was getting done, a little bit more outline done on the chest. It was just a concept I was working on probably you know, about six months ago, a drawing I did, and uh, I just drew it up and, you know, let him go. I was digging it, so. <laughs> you know, he had seen it and really liked it, you know, um, but kind of wanted to change a few things, you know, um, a few variations on it, so I did that, you know, and uh, <laughs> say if somebody wants to come in and get a piece of custom work, um, usually they'll set up a consultation talk with the artist, um, kind of get an idea on what they're trying to go for, and then I guess they leave it up to the artist to uh, have like uh, artistic freedom with the design. Usually like I'll start off with, you know, I'll sketch on the skin with a pen, you know, and then depends on how extravagant the design, you know, it's, it's usually broken up into sessions. We've been quite a few sessions now, so. I'll try to do like, you know, the outline and then do like a part of the shading, like say the black shading. And uh, that way, you know, that heals up pretty quick. You know, they can come back in within a week or two to get color put in. You know, usually got like two to three appointments per day. Um, start at noon, um, just work all day. I use a pneumatic machine, it's on compressed air. I'd say, you know, most people enjoy that a little bit more than you know, a traditional machine. You know, it's a little bit more gentle. I, I enjoy using the pneumatic. It's just more efficient. I guess being in the tattoo shop, you get so many different types of people, you know, and it's, it's kind of cool to interact with, you know, the, the broad spectrum of people, everybody from the military to the gangsters, you know, it's just like, you know, and everybody seems to to respect, you know, um, the art and the whole tattoo kind of, you know, lifestyle, I guess, you know. <laughs> There's days where I, you know, don't want to do it. Um, you know, it's a pretty demanding occupation, I guess. You know, people have expectations, and for the most part, you know, I enjoy what I do, and, you know, I get to put art on people for a living and get paid for it, so I mean, you really can't. I can't beat that, you know. I, mean, I can't think of a better place to work, you know. <laughs>